Okay, one second. So, <laughs> One Punch. I thought this was gonna be, I don't know, maybe like the Dragon Ball Z Kakarot playthrough. You know, you get to play as all these people. I was kind of excited for it. I didn't really look into the game. I enjoy the anime. I watch a good bit of anime. Come to find out, playing it, you actually make your own hero, which is neat. It just wasn't what I expected at the very beginning. But it was cool. You went through it. You kind of get some basic, basic things for your character. But no no big deal. I got to do it. I thought it was pretty dope. You know, you get to really master that. Like, the old school where things don't fit, you just kind of, like, upper and raise and lower and all that cool stuff to kind of go over it. So end all, finally do it. Go through my character. We're going to pick. We're going to go back to being the next one punch. We will show everybody how great of a hero we're going to be. Oh, so I think. That's how it's going to be. You know, COVID time, so I got to adjust the mask, make sure it's good. And once we get it all, you know what? We're going to knock it out and go straight up into it. Let's just finish it up and uh, see how this goes. You know, got to go for the sick purple because that's my jam. Go, 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 go. Yep. All right. Here we go. And back to the intro. <laughs> Here we go. The Let's start of the game. Up, Typically, like the One study. Punch Climax. anime, you kind of start the same way. There's a prologue prior to that where your guy gets saved. Who the hell are hero. You? He comes in, whoops the guy, by. does whatever, and then the game kind of opens up so you can kind of go through the hero. So we got a jumpster, huh? Well, I'll send you to hell it along with this one. just roughly follows my anime for the most part. Besides him, it moves on to Vaccine Man, and Genesis yeah. comes in, and next thing you know, you're kind of that awkward love triangle where Genesis wants to get trained by him. Your guy kind of wants to be there. You can make... Hey decisions okay or like choices i don't think it affects it because you kind of still go the same path but end all end all that's how it starts out then you go through this in this menu of new missions new things the organization wants you to do it's pretty mind-boggling how much of the same missions are the same missions i know this makes sense but you literally pick the same thing you go into a fight you do the same concept of what you do on the fight before says hero says monster the guy's randomly generated it is the same thing over and over until you hit like a high in the ranking then you go into a story mode and then it goes to like vaccine man and then you have that breakdown when you have these fights no matter what they are usually it's an online character that someone else makes that you kind of just they come and help you maybe you get you know a <laughs> tank top tiger or the moon man rider or any of them which is kind of neat i think the stingo comes in silver fang they're so stronger than your character most of the time, even though I'm constantly grinding these missions to see what's up and get my level up. It's still neat to kind of switch to them and see what fighting styles. You know, one punch comes in, he literally hits a guy for one punch. It's, you know, the big meme of the situation. Once you knock out enough of these or enough of the BS missions to get your rank high enough to get leveled up, you go into this menu of leveling up nonsense it's like hp do you want to go full tanky and just be a big old guy do you want to go glass cannon do you want your special moves that you get uh what kind of fighting type do you want if you have a basic fighting type and then you level up to level three so you have your killer move your killer moves do more by switching your battle type or fighting type i forget which one they call it it's either like the grapple strike or then you have weapon one weapon two for like the baseball bat sword moon man riders with his bike once you level them up, they start going. I went for mainly high, just melee damage, because you're always going to have the punching. I didn't really go HP, glass cannon all day. You can't get to this open world city where you walk around. It reminds me more of Sonic Adventure. I guess you can maybe say Yakuza for you newer guys. But like Sonic Adventure to me, because it was a big city that you kind of want to look at, but at the same time, it was so empty and dead. There's no point. Watching the anime, you kind of get this hook of walking around the city and maybe thinking, oh, this is kind of neat. This is what's going on. You eventually start getting emails, texts from the organization telling you, thank you, there's this, come to the shop, you clear this, the threat level's down, you can buy things through your little studio or apartment that you have. It's kind of neat-ish. It's like a crappier Skyrim version of buying a house. At least in Skyrim, it felt like it did something. This is just... MTV Cribs, but for yourself. Maybe maybe a buddy. You can't even invite any of your friends over. Um, you can't go into the gag. 
galleries and bios of people you meet it tells you a little bit more than what you already know about the character and all if you don't watch the anime this isn't your game if you bought the game and it straight came out maybe it's neat but it struggles to keep any kind of entertainment i'm doing the same thing over and over just to get to a new level to fight someone new or to follow some storyline that i really already know about i'd rather read the manga or watch the anime again than really look into it i think this is one of those games that you really just want to you want it you have to want it to want it I would give this game a maybe, a, a guaranteed 2 out of 5, unless you can maybe get this thing for six nine nine seven nine nine all the DLC, maybe even 10 bucks, and I would give this like a 3 out of 5 for a super good deal. But on its best day, personally, especially for the price tag, easily, easily 2 out of 5, nothing more, nothing less. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it, you guys enjoyed watching, I appreciate that you guys stopped by every time. I have a new review coming out next week. Please make sure you stop by. Have a good one, guys. Come on. Oh, you got it.